Hello everyone, it's Living Online here for Server Pro, and today I'll be showing you how to download and set up the Open Audio MC plugin on your server. Firstly, I'll be showing you a brief overview of what the plugin is and what it does, and then I'll show you how to set it up on your own server. There are timestamps in the description if you wish to jump to a specific section. The Open Audio MC plugin basically adds music and proximity voice chat without mods. The proximity voice chat feature allows players to talk to one another through their web client with spatial audio implemented. The music feature adds theming and sound effects by placing speakers throughout your world, mixing ambient music and adding NPC voice lines. Not only that, but you can customize your own UI with your theme color, images, and messages. Overall, the plugin allows a huge amount of configuration and settings and all of them easily accessible. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to manually set up the Open Audio MC plugin. In order to set it up manually, you'll have to download the Open Audio plugin, which you can do by heading to this page. The link to it will be in the description. When you're there, all you have to do is press the Download Now button. That'll instantly download the Open Audio plugin file. When it's done, we recommend dragging it to your desktop so it's easier to follow the next few steps. To set up the Open Audio plugin on your server, you'll have to head to the server.pro website. When you're there, head into your server's control panel. At the server dashboard, make sure that your server's type is set to SPIGA and that the version is compatible with the plugin version. We downloaded the latest 1.19 file, so the server has been set to 1.19.2, but the latest file version may change in the future, so please check before continuing. Before proceeding, make sure the server is offline and then you can head to the Files tab. There you'll see a Plugins folder. Double click that folder to open it up and once it's open, all you have to do is drag in the Open Audio plugin file you downloaded earlier. It'll take a millisecond to upload, so when that's done, you can turn your server on. In the meantime, you can head to the console. There you'll know that the server has started correctly if it says Done. Note that if your server is still online when installing the plugin, please restart your server fully to enable the plugin. Please don't type in slash reload in the console as this can cause errors. To make sure everything is working as intended in game, you want to head to your dashboard and copy the host name. Afterwards, start up your Minecraft application and when the game is open, head to the multiplayer section. Click add server and in the server address section, paste the host name. When that's done, double click to enter your server and after the server is finished loading up, you'll know the plugin is working if you get this message. You'll then have to type in the command slash OA accept to accept the terms of service. If it says you don't have permission to use that command, you'll have to make yourself an operator. Since all players have to use that command, we recommend the LuckPerms plugin to give everyone else the right permissions. If you're not sure on how to use luck perms, we've made a video showing you how to do so, so make sure to click the link in the description. However, if you trust the other players on your server and want to make them operator as well, feel free to do so. If you don't know how to do that, there'll be a link in the description to a video that we've done before. Once you've agreed to the terms of service, to have access to proximity chat and other perks, you have to click on here and then press yes to open a window on your browser. When it's loaded, press anywhere on the screen to proceed. This page will appear. We recommend keeping it open whilst you play on your server to hear the in-game music and sound effects. However, to join voice chat on your server, you have to press the join voice chat button on the main page. That'll redirect you to a page where you can do a couple of things. Firstly, if you talk, you can see your player icon light up, indicating your voice is being transmitted to other players if they're on the server. If you would rather them not be able to hear you, you can always mute as well. Next to that, you can see a volume slider. You can turn the chat volume for other players up or down here. Lastly, there's also a settings menu you can open up. You can choose what input device you want selected, change the microphone sensitivity, and a bunch of other options. On the settings tab at the top, there's also a range of other options you can adjust. Well, that's it for this video. If you have any more questions, make sure to leave them down below. And if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to see more from our channel. Thank you for watching.